Hey yo guys, so this is a guide on how to get back to Firelink Shrine starting from Vamos Bonfire. As soon as you get here, you have to wait for a second on this hill and then just follow the bond wheels with your camera. Then you have to roll past them and just follow them to dodge and look at the one bond wheel that's in front of you to dodge him too. So your main goal is to get to these flying heads because when they explode they make a kind of a shield for you as their explosion will kill the bomb wheels and then after this you're pretty much safe you have to run and roll to get past this because there's two archers and a pyromancer then you have to climb the ladder and avoid the skeleton which is not always there there's gonna be another skeleton which for some reason in my game was facing a wall and there's more stair climbing Now, as soon as you get to this door, you have to go left, because on the right there's a titanic demon which could kill you, and you have to go to the left. After this, it's pretty simple, you have to just run, and we're gonna find a bonfire soon. So just run, pick up your shield, because it's gonna be very useful, one block is gonna do it for every single skeleton. Sometimes they don't, they don't even attack, so it's pretty easy. Then you have to get in here and run up the spiral staircase. And then from here on it's pretty simple, you have to just run again. And we're gonna reach the first bonfire or the illusory wall. Sometimes you get to this bonfire and the enemies will follow you so you won't be able to light the bonfire. But if you have killed the pyromancer while you were descending to Capcom or you have a divine weapon, you can kill the skeletons and just rest on the bonfire. However, if you haven't killed them or you don't use a divine weapon, then killing the skeletons won't do anything because they will respawn and you can light the bonfire as they are spawning. Now you have to get inside this door, which is on the right of the bonfire, follow the corridor and turn right as soon as you can. Then you have to go up the spiral staircase and pick up your shield to block the skeletons. And now you have to be careful, because the pyromancer is gonna keep shooting you if he's alive. He shouldn't be, but in my game he's alive because I like to show the hardest way in case you haven't killed them either. Once you're here, you have to just dodge the skeletons and go straight forward while being careful of the archers and pyromancers. So you have to dodge these last few monsters, then turn right as soon as you can and go back on the first bridge of the catacombs. I almost died here, but you should. I don't even have that much vitality for the purpose of this guide. If it's hard, then it's a good guide, I think. Then yeah, you rest at the bonfire and you're pretty much done. From here on out, I'm just going to backtrack back to Firelink Shrine because that's my bay place. This is pretty straightforward, you just have to run. And this guy, really, you can just run to his right, but I didn't this time because I was using a new controller. And yeah. Here you will get out of the catacombs, reach the graveyard, which you can just run through, and you're back to Firelink Shrine. I hope you guys liked this video and enjoyed it, I hope it will be of some help to some of you. It's pretty simple once you get the hang of it, but getting that in catacombs can be a hustle, so thank you for watching.